So this vacant school in southwest Detroit has turned into a whole lot more than just an eyesore. There is quite a story here. Firefighters are constantly getting called out to the old Phoenix Academy, including just this morning. Sean Lay live for us tonight, and there really isn't much of anything to keep people out of this building, Sean. I can show you so much here. We just have a limited amount of time. First thing this morning, Detroit firefighters, they alerted me. They were back here again the 11th time in a year at Phoenix Academy. The district, school district, they're below, they, it's responsible for this. They put up the plastic here to keep people out. It doesn't here. The fire was here today. It melted that plastic off. Careful, my photographer, Jeff, it is really dangerous around here. But if you come, the fire was in here, it's wide open. I'm going to show you this. This is new to us. The letters, Phoenix Academy, melting right off the side of the building. The city of Detroit knocks buildings, dangerous buildings like these down all the time to get rid of them. The school district, they own this one. What's new, they do have a permit for demolition. When that demo will happen is unknown. Our cameras are there this morning to capture Detroit firefighters once again called to what used to be the school Phoenix Academy. DEPSCD closed the school, secured the building, but as you can see, it remains one of Detroit's most dangerous buildings, dangerous to the neighborhood. This mom will not let her kids near it. I see the smoke coming out the door and I'm like, yeah, it's on fire. So I called it in and they're still continuing playing as the fire is being put out. Dangerous for firefighters who tell us they're frustrated. Vandals have set the building on fire dozens of times and you may not have seen this drone footage taken by a neighbor. Those are kids on the roof of this building. Typically, the city of Detroit would have a building this dangerous taken down in an emergency demolition. DPSCD owns this building, tries to secure it often. It has picked a contractor to bring the building down. But as you can see, it is still here, attracting kids, attracting vandals. It is a massive neighborhood danger zone. And those firefighters here today expressing how frustrated they are. I asked Detroit Fire today if they have gone to DPSCD or the city to team up and say, let's find a solution here to bring the building down. Detroit Fire says the Detroit Fire Department will continue with our commitment to doing whatever it takes to keep our citizens safe. We want the community to know the severity of fires being set in any building. If anyone has any information on suspicious fires, to call the arson tip line. So nonspecific about that, you can see how wide open this is. Again, what's new is DPSCD. The city tells me has applied for a permit for demo. They have picked a contractor, a date set for this place, though. N not yet, not in time, and people want this place down. Yeah, I mean, firefighters are putting their lives on the line trying to fix this situation and solve it. Meantime, Big what time. are neighbors Big telling time. you, Sean? It's interesting. They tell me a lot, and they're very concerned about this place. The campus is huge, as I can show you, and they want the place to come down. They don't always want to talk on camera. They kind of want to be private about it. This is the neighborhood right here kids everywhere. This school really was a big part of the community, but right now it's a big danger in this community. Yeah, you got kids playing in the neighborhood and you're worried about what's going to happen if they go in that area. All right, we know you'll stay on top of it. Thanks, Sean.